Now to the counties where Education Cabinet Secretary Professor George Magoha is warning schools against flouting the Ministry of Education directive. Magoha read the riot act to an undisclosed school which he says is currently conducting physical classes for learners in all grades in violation of the government's directive. Meanwhile, Kennedy Mat Michira Mainya, the MC of Kiamakoma Ward in Masaba South, has died after a short illness. More details in the county briefs. <laughs> Residents of Kiyomokama Ward, Masaba South, Kisi County, are mourning the death of the area MCA Kennedy Mishira Mainya. Mainya passed away while he was being transferred to Nairobi for specialized treatment. The late MCA was admitted briefly at Oasis Hospital in Kisi Town before he was referred for specialized treatment in Nairobi. He, however, passed away en route to Nairobi. Residents have been warned against speculating on his course of death and await post mortem results. Since Kama County Assembly Service Board, na wajumbe wanajua tutafanya iwesavyo tuhakikishe kwamba mahali usaidisi yanataikana tunapeana kulingana na vile yanataikana Separately in Nairobi Education ACS Professor George Magoha was in Mukuru Primary School to assess the progress of learners it is here that he ordered an unnamed a school from conducting physical classes for other learners who are not in grade 4 or candidates We are physically inspecting at 100% and after the 100% inspection, payment is going to be given. At the same time, he reiterated that the government's commitment to ensure safety of learners in the wake of the pandemic, as citing the situation in Miranda Boys, is under control. I think that by Friday, we shall be in a very good state to tell the nation that this exercise is complete. Elsewhere, Health workers under the national government and the county of Nairobi are on strike to push for promotions. They say they have stagnated in the same job group for 15 years. And despite the ministry promising to effect promotions to the affected 15 cadres, it has not been honored. The strike will affect, among others, port health facilities, including airports, border points and all port entries. We are saying health workers are not going to go back until they get promotion and realization we further want to appeal to his to head of public service to come in and to intervene so that service delivered to kenyans uh, it, it becomes a business continuity in the meantime five people among them a family of three from miley in a trading center in Nyandaro north area are nursing serious burn wounds after a leaking gas cylinder exploded the injured were taken to the nyahururu county and referral hospital where medics have said they're out of danger Families have been warned to ensure cylinders are properly sealed to avoid such incidences. Finally, over 200 sand harvesters have protested the blocking of access routes to mining sites by the ownership of Kidong Ranch, a 76,000 acre piece of land between Naruk and Nakuru and Kajado. The irate group are threatening to destroy a ring of fences erected around the land if the government doesn't step in and address their plight. The harvesters say the land is a source of livelihoods for over 500 households. When attacker kututoa by force, kuingia ndani ya kuweka matinga, Ianze kupakilia magari na ndiye risiki yetu kama watu wa kijiko. Uji tumechata hiyo mchanga kwa muda mrefu sana na tujai waona. Sijua na kuanga wapi. Wanakuja kusema wama kidong ni yao. Pame kufungia manjia. Yusufar, Channel 1.